everyone. Today I'll be sharing some tips I learned that has helped me write nicer on the iPad and I want to share these with you. When I first started on the iPad, um, my handwriting was atrocious. It did not match what my writing did on paper and it was a bit discouraging to use the iPad. So the first thing that I learned was to write smaller. Um, the reason is because you can control your writing a lot better when you're writing smaller and then you can always resize to make it bigger. At first it felt a bit awkward to have to zoom in so much to write something, but it actually works really well. Another feature I can use is this magnifying glass in GoodNotes and it zooms in at the bottom so you can have the same effect without zooming into the whole page. My second tip is to buy a pencil grip. Um, it took me a while to actually purchase this um, and I just got it from Staples. It's super cheap unless you want something a little bit more fancy. There's a huge selection on Amazon but because the Apple Pencil is just so thin it's really hard to control how you write sometimes. So I actually really enjoy using it for more control with my writing. My third tip is to use a matte screen protector. I held off on buying this for the longest time and just used any screen protector that I had. And I found that the glossy ones just made me slip and slide everywhere and that gives me harder control on my writing. So if you want better control, having a matte screen protector like Paperlike or any of the other ones you find on Amazon would be best so that you can have that paper like feel and have some kind of friction while you're writing and not just on glass. And my fourth tip is to adjust your pen settings to fit your writing style. In GoodNotes there are three different types of pens and I've actually defaulted to the ballpoint pen because it seems like it just fits my writing style a lot better. I put a lot of pressure on my writing so the brush pen and the fountain pen just comes out a little bit weird for me. But if you look into the settings of the fountain pen and the brush pen, you can actually adjust um, the pressure and the ballpoint size to whatever uh, style outcome that you want to achieve. I hope you enjoyed my tips for improving your writing on the iPad and in GoodNotes. I'll link some links below so you can know um, where to get some of the things that I mentioned. And if you like these videos, please subscribe. Thank you.